Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we've got some exciting news from the world of CPUs. Intel is gearing up to adopt AMD's groundbreaking 3D vCache technology. Well, sort of. But hold on, don't get your hopes up just yet, especially if you're a gamer. Let's dive into the details of what Intel has planned and how it could shape the future of processors. So here's the scoop. Intel is planning to introduce its version of AMD's 3D vCache technology, but instead of targeting gaming PCs, they're focusing on the server market. That's right, Intel's new cache tile processors are designed for high-performance workloads in data centers and technical computing environments. According to Intel's Florian Meislinger, the company is working on server processors with large shared L3 caches. Think about applications like AI, cloud computing, and heavy simulations, areas where AMD's Epic processors, like the Genoa X and upcoming Turin X, are already dominating. Now, if you're a gamer, this might feel like a letdown. AMD's 3D vCache tech has proven to be a game changer, literally. The Ryzen 7 9800X 3D with its massive L3 cache is currently the best gaming CPU on the market, delivering incredible performance and staying cool under pressure. But here's the thing, Intel isn't planning to bring this kind of technology to their gaming CPUs anytime soon. In fact, their latest Arrow Lake S processors didn't even manage to surpass their older Raptor Lake chips in gaming performance. Intel has admitted there are correctable issues with the Arrow Lake S lineup and is working on updates that might improve performance. But for now, AMD has the clear upper hand when it comes to gaming. So why is Intel prioritizing servers over gaming? It all comes down to demand and profitability. Data centers are booming thanks to advancements in AI and cloud computing, and this market is far more lucrative for Intel than gaming CPUs. With their new Xeon processors featuring larger caches, Intel is looking to go head-to-head -head with AMD in the server space. These chips are expected to excel in cache-sensitive workloads like Ansys, OpenFoam, and more potentially giving Intel a much-needed edge in this sector. Meanwhile, AMD is crushing it with their Ryzen 7 9800X 3D. This processor has been flying off the shelves and is even hard to find in some regions. Reports say certain stores won't have stock until early 2025. It's no surprise, the 9800X 3D delivers unmatched gaming performance and energy efficiency, earning it rave reviews across the board. Intel, on the other hand, is still struggling to address issues with their 13th and 14th gen processors. From voltage problems to game crashes, they've had their fair share of challenges. So, if you're a PC enthusiast or someone looking to upgrade, the current landscape makes one thing clear. AMD is leading the charge in gaming CPUs, and it doesn't look like that's going to change anytime soon. That's all for today's update. What do you think about Intel's decision to focus on servers over gaming? Are you excited to see how this plays out, or do you feel like they're missing an opportunity? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more tech news and reviews, and turn on notifications so you never miss an update. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.